Hold on, folks. I'm going to show you how to make this yummy steak roll-up. It has uh, sun-dried tomatoes, uh, pesto with uh, red bell peppers, and mozzarella cheese inside. Please stay tuned and watch step-by-step step what I do. First of all, you're going to get three sirloin cut, very, very thin steaks. You're going to ask your butcher to cut them very thin. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take a mallet and you're going to tenderize these steaks. Just like this. Just make sure that you get every spot. This way you know that your steak is going to be really tender. This is a step you should not skip. If you don't have a meat tenderizer, you can use forks, two forks together. Then I put adobo over my steak and as you see the sun-dried tomato pesto I put a tablespoon on each steak and I spread it all over the steaks. This is what gives the steak the flavor. So you're wanting to spread this all over your steak. You could also add a little bit of olive oil if you need to to spread it a little bit easier. I actually did end up doing that but I didn't video it. I'm sorry. Sue me. <laughs> and now that you have all that on there, you're going to put some roasted red bell peppers on top of that, just like that. And you're going to get some mozzarella cheese. And you're going to put mozzarella on each one of those steaks and then you're going to roll them up one by one just like this and after you get them all rolled up you're going to add more adobo on the outside of the steak try to roll it, roll it over a little bit and put it on all sides of it then I added it onto um, some tin foil and I put it in my air fryer at 350 for 25 minutes but um, after 12 minutes I had turned the roll over so it cooks the other side now if you don't want yours cooked too much cut the time in half and roll it over every six minutes if you want it like a medium rare um, this came out cooked. That's the way I wanted it because I wanted my cheese melted in the middle. And believe me, it is delicious. I hope you try this. I served this with a side of broccoli and cauliflower um, with a adobo seasoning and just butter. That's all I had on it, just butter. Um, I figured there was enough cheese in the steak. I didn't need to put it on the broccoli too. But that's my cooking video for today. Okay, I added a little bit of cheese. Just a little bit. A mozzarella. <laughs> anyway, you caught me. I hope you try this, guys. Um, it's really, really, really good. But I did cook that in my air fryer. You can cook it in your oven. You could cut it, cut it into slices and put toothpicks in it and cook it on the stove. It just depends, you know, what you have to cook with. But try it out. It's really, really good. I love you all. Hey everyone, do me a favor and share out my video. Um, please, if you would, make sure that you like my video. And don't forget to ring that bell. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe and ring the bell. And God bless you all. And leave me a comment down below if you would.
I really enjoy those. I miss all of you. Love you. Bye.